checking the latest numbers of confirmed cases of COVID-19 here in Alabama. As of moments ago, we still have 39 confirmed cases in our state. Two of those in North Alabama, one again in Limestone County and the one we told you about in Madison County and new at six. All 50 states have now reported confirmed cases of COVID-19. Moments ago, West Virginia just reported its first case. These numbers are expected to rise, but one Huntsville company wants to slow the growth by testing more. Those results would lead to quick isolation for those infected. Today, Diatherix began accepting specimens for a new coronavirus test. These samples collected from doctor's offices will be run through its lab and then checked for coronavirus. Our Chris Joseph went to Hudson Alpha to take a look. Chris, how quickly does this test get results? Yet, yeah, Liz, they get results the same day, and they can do it in pretty big quantities. Researchers here say that during a normal flu season, so nothing like this, they can churn out a thousand tests a day. Now, with the coronavirus, of course, that number is expected to go up. Now, the company's president says because the test is built differently, it doesn't face the same supply chain issues other tests are facing right now. Importantly, the company is only accepting test requests from doctors and health organizations like you just said, Liz. So don't come to Hudson Alpha and ask for a test. Uh, you have to go through your doctor. However, the company says it's ramping up production for the long haul. We're ready for the long term because this is what we do and we've always done this and there has been many a times before um, you know you have H1N109. We were here back then. We had the emergency use authorization back then from the CDC. Now, of course, those tests are going to be needed. Right now, Huntsville Hospital says it's waiting on results from roughly 30 tests. Reporting in Huntsville, Chris Joseph, WAFF, 